queers on the farm, you know, not only challenges the, you know, stereotype of who is a farmer and what does a farmer uh, look like, but it also challenges the stereotype of like, you know, what do queers look like and where do you find queers and, and what are queers doing? Sun won't be a supernova, but still one day a nebula wishes to say I'm hanging on as if this year could last that long. Shoot down fingernails on sandstone, gripping at the last heat on the phone. I swear it was there, not even that long ago. Maybe question is so much like, you know, what does my queerness bring or, or how does my queerness affect or impact my farming? I think it's so much as like, what does justice, because that's my motivation in doing it. Anybody can plant a tomato, anybody can raise a tomato. But what does justice and food look like from my black, gay perspective, you know? Our friend said, yeah, you're changing Kansas one family at a time, you know. I think if people, when people realize, especially in small towns, it's like, I'm just like you. I'm, I've got a farm, I'm raising a family, you know, we work hard. If you need a, a village to raise a child, you definitely need a community to have a sustainable food source. I am because you are and I am because you are